this is my on portable DVD player and with the charging indicator the remote sensor and the Bluetooth and the Bluetooth indicator is always blue and the remote sensor lets you send signal from the remote control and the charging indicator is red when it is charging but when it Turns and it has been completely charged, and I got the remote right here, but it's not the phone. It's just remote control for the DVD player, and LCD on or off, and let you turn on or off the screen. And you got the source button that you change the input. Got some light in it. And surprise, and got the number buttons. And got the zero and the ten button. You got ten plus, which takes you to chapter ten or higher. Got the volume buttons. You got the mute button. You got the menu button, which takes you to the root menu. It's, uh, Allows you to ch change the preferences of the DVD player. You got the L buttons, and you got the OK button, which is the same as the select or the enter button. You got the on screen disc, the OSD button, the on screen display button. You check how many time left, and what how many chapters you're on. You got the USB card button, and let you change the input from USB DVD to USB or DVD to card you got the subtitle button let you change the language to turn on or on the subtitles and change language and the step button it lets you I don't the step button lets you go into pause to the next frame and you've got the start button which interrupts or changes the progress you got the title button which takes you to the top menu you got the angle button which changes the angle of it changes the scene of the of a program and you got the zoom button which changes the viewing option and let you peek in or peek out you got the go to button which is chapter and title chapter time search and you got the audio button which changes the language of the sound you got the program button which stores tires in the memory and you got the AB repeat button which repeats from the desired starting point to the desired end point and you got the slow button which lowers the playback speed you got the repeat button which lets you watch the tire chapter on the whole disc again and you got the playing hard button and pause let you interrupt the playback and press and stop one time we cancel the playback you got the rewind button and speed available two four eight sixteen thirty two and with the fast forward button and the rewind button that you go back to a desired time and it should go forward to a desired time the previous and you back to the previous to the, to the chapter and the next button takes you to a chapter after another you to another chapter and you have the 
You know what this is? Your camp, sorry about that. And you've got the USB input, you've got the SD card input, and and uh, you've you got the headphone input, and you got the AV output and input, and you got the power switch, you got the DC input, and let me open the DVD player. And it's got. Swivel angle and let you rotate the screen to 270, 180, 90 to 180. That's neat. And put it back to zero degrees. And these are the Buttons on the DVD player, and then and I'm gonna open the DVD player tray, and then I got the Monster House wide screen edition, and that used to be Andrea's, but now it's mine, and Andrea gave it to me as a birthday present. On June 20th, 2017. Excuse me. I'm going to turn the DVD player on and see what happens. The DVD player is loading. And the blue one is blinking. Because it's trying to search for a Bluetooth device. And if I see DVD video. Let me go to the root menu. And the last memory takes me where I left off at. Let me mute it due to copyright issue. A BT pair button that your pair and device to another pooch like this one and this next book. Both support Bluetooth. Let's eject the disc. on mute and the channels you got the television display okay it is angle mark on or off you no pants here no one there about one sixteen to nine it's available in English French Spanish German you may turn on or off Left memory can be turned on or off, and seam here and helps reduce energy consumption. And down memory can be left to right or stereo. And Dolby Digital setup, and dual monitor, and these four options: stereo, left mono, right mono, mixed mono. And dynamic can go from off to one a to one four to three a to one half to five eighths to three four to seven eighths to one hundred percent four and one. Come on! The port P D V D picture that means portable D V D player picture. And you got the sharpness settings. High, medium, and low. The brightness contract Q, which is the tint and saturation. If you decrease the saturation, it reduces. Then it increases color. If you reduce the, it, then it changes. 
I'm going to show you what happens. If I decrease the hue settings, it will look greener. The picture would look greener. If I adjust it to hard, then it would look... If I adjust the hue to loud, then it would look redder. And if I adjust the hue to hard, then it gets greener. Put the hue at zero. Contrast and brightness go from dim to bright. But preference pans change. NTSC is used in North American parts of Southeast parts of Asia, and pounds used mostly in Europe and some. of Asia and all of Africa not all but some parts of Africa you see them it's also used in France and the former Soviet Union countries in all new settings English, French, German, Spanish, Dutch, Chinese, Japanese, Korean, Russian, Thai And sometimes same thing. This menu same thing. Parental guidance. One kid safe. Two G. All ages. Three P G. Parental guidance suggested not suitable for young children. Four is P G fourteen. Not suitable for children under thirteen. Five is P G R. Not suitable for children under 17 and are restricted for ch children under 17 and no children under 17 and adult mature audiences 18 and up only. And I notice why my storage is getting full and password. One is six digits in default takes you to the previous factory settings and I don't want that. Let me close the tray and I will catch you in point I mean I'll catch you in point two and I'll see you later